House for the debate on bike lanes in Appleton last night. The lanes would go in on Mason Street, but the plan would also eliminate a lot of parking. Fox 11's Alex Ronaldo has balanced coverage. About 70 people attended Tuesday's Municipal Services Committee meeting in Appleton. Of those, dozens spoke during more than three hours of debate. When it was over, the committee voted 3-2 to two to approve the proposal for bike lanes on Mason Street. It was a very impassioned, persuasive argument that came from both sides from that audience. The plan would add bike lanes on both sides of 30 blocks on Mason Street, but it would remove street parking from all but about two of those blocks. Many citizens worry this will hurt homeowners, businesses, churches, and schools on that street. Pastor Paul Schuller with St. Matthew Lutheran Church says parking is already an issue for his congregation on Mason Street. He says the bike lanes will make it worse. Concern for the elderly and the handicapped that they can't get close enough. And I really don't want to see, well, I can't find a place to park to keep somebody from coming to church. But bike lane supporters say while they do sympathize, they agree with the plan. Parking is really the storage of private property on public land. It's a privilege. It's not a right. Tom Walsh with Fox City's Greenways says the bike lanes will help bring more tourism and business into Appleton. He says they will also make cycling safer. They can see the bike coming down the road and not see them, you know, where they'd be behind a car. So you greatly enhance safety by putting a bike lane in along the curb. Schuler says he fears the bike lanes will actually add danger, especially at intersections where the lanes would end. Which means they are going to blend with traffic. And yeah, that's a concern. I have a feeling that there's going to be accidents there. But while the committee passed the plan, it's not a done deal. The full common council needs to vote on it. It's a recommendation for the council. Mm -hmm. Council doesn't have to do to accept what we've recommended. The council's next meeting is May 1st, so both sides will have more time to voice their opinions. In Appleton, Alex Ronaldo, Fox 11 News. The Mason Street proposal is part of Appleton's overall 20-year bike lane plan, which was adopted in 2010. Last night, the Municipal Services Committee also voted to review the entire plan before June 26 this year. That means if the Common Council approves both measures, no work will go forward until after that date.